All right, so you've probably been using Tableau Prep and you've gotten a file and you've done your cleaning and all the steps and all the joins and unions and aggregates and all that stuff. And then a new file comes in. Well, how do you replace the old file with the new file? In this video, I'm going to show you exactly how to do that. And before we begin, be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell because I publish new videos every Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. So let's head over to Tableau. All right, we've got two files to work on today, and we're going to uh, begin with the remap one. And if you want to follow along, these files are available in the description below. So go ahead and download them if you want to join in. And we're going to load up remap one. All right. So we've got our data set there and you know, we're going to do a bunch of steps and aggregates, right? Uh, I'm just picking anything really, some profit maybe, right? And then we're doing an output and you know, maybe we've done a very complex one. So lots of little kind of steps along the way. And then someone goes, listen, I've got a new file. Can you load that one up instead? Well, how do we actually replace it with a new file? Well, what we do is we grab the new file right? And we drop it into Tableau prep as well, like so. And then you'll see that the file has been loaded up like this. So the way to rewire it, as I like to call it, is we need to get rid of this particular connection right here. So what we can do is we can right click here, simply click remove. And then we take the new one. And this is where I think people get confused. You take the new one and you drag it over where you want to connect it to. And I like to call it like you're joining it to the bum. <laughs> you're joining it to the bum of the next one, right? And you'll see that little function add there and that will do the rewire. And very important, delete the old one, right? And then remove the connection if you don't need it anymore. Because this is where a lot of confusion happens is you start using the wrong file and the wrong connection and that's when problem starts to happen. So if you learned something from this video, be sure to drop me a like, helps with the YouTube algorithm a lot. Be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell because I release new videos every Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. Until then, have a great day and bye.